Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Heat. It is kind of a lovely day, actually. I can hear it. I can hear the crows. I think they're crows. <laughs> it's funny. I get. I I have crows where I live, so it it to me it's like. Am, am I am I actually in the game, or is that how? Whoa! Look at that. All kind of well, almost all upgraded. Look at this. I will tell you something right now. The um, <laughs> grinding the stones for for doing this work. Oh my, <laughs> it's a lot of work. Um, whoa, okay, that was a bit weird. Um, uh, how are we doing here? Okay, let's take a quick boo. Uh, I was on a little earlier because I was doing some, you know, all the grindy stuff, and I lit the fire to get uh, to get charcoal and stuff like that. And um, but uh, and then I I don't like recording at night, so I let the day I let the night pass, and I came back on. And so, yeah, I'm just trying to make sure that there's nothing weird going on around here. No, no, uh, strange characters lurking about. Um, all right, now, so I, and the other thing is, I actually did uh, have some stone made while I was away out of materials. Yeah, there's a funky, um, it does this sort of uh, cancel. It's weird because uh, essentially, it does. It is because it it ran out of materials. But I I was actually uh, asking it to make exactly what it needed. So there is some there is something funky with the uh, with the its measurement of how many materials and stuff like that. But we're not going to worry about that. All right. So <clears throat> there's a few things that I there's a little bit of um, overhead that I need to take care of. But first, we're going to finish upgrading these last two blocks because uh i was so close and then i needed more <laughs> so let's uh there we go nice come on one more yes and then we'll get you just upgrading there we go all right one fully sort of upgraded slab yeah, it's a bit boring. It's just kind of a square <laughs> for now, uh, but I think it'll work out just fine. And then we're gonna have to. I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna build on it. It. Uh, I haven't quite figured that out yet. So we're gonna see. But that is not the objective of today's uh, episode. To the objective of today is something a little different. Um, here, let me put away the uh, the extra. See, look at that. All that. The, all that stone. Gone. Just absolutely gone. Oh, I do have another 80 in here. Right. Yeah, because I was I was working on it. Uh, we have a lot of other materials, though. So we're doing pretty good as far as materials are concerned. There's a few things that, that I need help with. You may notice my water in the bottom right-hand corner is a little low. And it's weird because... Uh, here, let me show you. If I were to... Uh, well, first of all, my clay jug is uh, is really in bad shape. You can see it's got almost no green left. So we're going to refill it, right? And then if I were to... Actually, let's refill the, uh, the little backup jug as well. There we go. Oh, it's almost dead too. That's amazing. Okay, so... Here, I'll show you. Oh, and by the way, I'm in... <laughs> I always forget... There we go. I actually like third person in this game. So, you know, um, I usually don't, but this one, it actually works really well. Okay, so I'll show you. Actually, before we drink, let's take a look at my situation. Uh, my hydration is like, uh, what is that? 20% 20, 20 between 20 and 30% somewhere in that region. Um, not, not quite 20, but close. So here, let's have a, a few drinks. I, I'm not sure if this is gonna be the same, Okay, we're going to have a few, so... And I don't know if it's because the water jug is almost dead or if it's something else, but there we go. I had three drinks. I'm going to drink half this jug. Okay, so we've had five drinks, right? Um, so if we take a look now, my hydration isn't going up. It's weird. So I, I think it might be that this jug has had it. So we're gonna, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make a new jug. And I'm, if I remember correctly, I have to do it in here. And what I do is I have to make a, the formula first, so I need clay for that. You know what, dude? Put that jug away. Put it away. You don't need it. It's broken. Okay, so we're gonna grab a bit of clay, and then we come over here, and we, uh, we say, hey, uh, craft one of those bad boys up. Uh, 
Not sure how long it takes. 20 seconds. Okay. All right. Now, the other that is one thing I need to get done today. The other thing, and the primary goal for today is, if we take a look at the Becknology page. Um, oh, uh, I should clarify. Okay, so this bone pickaxe, I've actually repaired it like a, a couple of times now because I've been doing a lot of grinding. Um, here, I'll show you. Uh, yeah, I've got uh, $2,600 saved up. Um, and that <laughs> that takes a little while. It's not difficult, but it takes time, right? So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to, not that, we need to do it here, and we're going to go into the tools. There we are. Uh, I want to get up to the iron woodcutter's axe and the iron pickaxe. So you, that's why I needed money. See, the iron pickaxe is $600. The copper pickaxe is $300. Uh, I don't know if these axes, yeah, that, that copper hatchet requires $300. 600 for the iron hatchet we may not even be able to get because that that's a lot of money so but we're going to make an effort um the pickaxe i'm going to do first because i i think the pickaxe is 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 better bang for the buck right now so i need four four timber and four copper ingots oh hang on it's before I'm, I'm dying of thirst let's get that sorted out first focus all uh, right now and then if i remember correctly we have to come over to our happy friendly oh let's grab here, we'll cheat. We'll just grab a bit of charcoal. Um, now, I was, you know, at first, back be when I, be at the beginning, I was like, what is the advantage of charcoal? Because, I don't know, it just seems, other than the fact that the uh, the timber mill requires charcoal, like, why, 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 what's the, the bonus with charcoal? And I, I think I, there is one bonus. Charcoal does not leave any, um, it burns hot. So it's like one of the hottest burning ones, but it doesn't leave any um, byproduct. So fat leaves sulfur, sticks and wood leave charcoal. I think sticks leave charcoal. Um, and then, of course, you get down to the lower temperature stuff, which you don't really want to get into anyways. But uh, so th and that where that becomes important is because uh, the these slots, you know, you can stack up. Someone was telling me in the comments so that you can stack these up. Yeah, I do that. I, I'll put in like three or four stacks of iron or, uh, yeah, iron. And then le that leaves a couple of bit of room for, um, the, uh, the, the, the refined, uh, iron bars. And then also the, uh, if I'm using sulfur, uh, the, the fat, then it, it leaves a place for the sulfur to go. But if you, uh, if you use charcoal, then basically that frees up one spot so you can load up more uh, raw materials in there. So that's actually kind of an advantage. Am I doing this wrong? Oh, no, there it is. What am I doing? <laughs> well, it, it happened while I was uh, blathering. You know what? Is this worth anything? 44 cents. Okay. Oh, yeah, I've been, I've been doing stuff. Here, we're just going to... Well, no, I'm not going to ship it. I know what I'll do. I'll put it in my uh, backup, my uh, used broken uh, containers and stuff like that. There we go. And then we're going to come out here. I'm going to refill our brand new jug with water. Um, see, does this need repair as well? I'm not sure. It's very strange. Okay, so we'll refill you. Oh. You're broken. Is that, is that right? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not. Did I pick up? Did I put away the wrong one? Hang on. I might have put away the wrong one. Maybe I did. That would be very foolish. And it would be. Oh, no. There it is. Okay. So I think there was a. It, because I had. Well, let's. Okay. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to try this. No, I don't need to do that. We're going to try this one more time. But we're going to change something. Um. We're going to go in here. We're going to say, give us uh, another one of those. Okay. And uh, here, let's try and drink. Uh, it See, it does a little hit to the water, but I might have to run down to the beach because uh, I appear to be unable to quench this thirst. You see that? So, and if we take a look now at my... Uh, See, my hydration just keeps going down. It's really strange. So uh, what I might do is uh, to fix this problem, what I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this one away so that now in my inventory, I don't have any water jugs, right? Oh, in fact, I'm even going to put this one away too. It's raining outside. Holy moly, look at that. 
Ooh. You could tell because it's raining inside the building, too. <laughs> Shoddy workmanship. Who built this place? Um, <laughs> you did. Let's not talk about that. Okay. Uh, we should be able to make another one of you. There we go. Okay. So that's fine. And then we'll put the money away. Do, 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 do. Uh, now, this, of course, we're still not into the, pr the the main goal of this episode, but I do want to... Uh, uh, yeah, see, look at how fast that is. It doesn't take long at all. But I really want to find out, and I wish we could... You can't drink out of the clay watering jug. I tried. It, it wants you to water things. So if you put it in your hand and then try to use it, it basically starts sort of... Here, I'll, I'll show you. It's actually quite amusing. What? It just does this. <laughs> so it actually starts watering stuff. <laughs> I just watered the ground. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, do we get another jug? We should be getting a jug any second now. Come on. Come on. C come on. Actually, by the way, this was super handy to put here because I can make charcoal here, and then I just shove it in here. It's actually really neat. There we go. Okay, so now we got a new jug. I don't have an old jug. And I, what I was wondering is if the, the, it didn't like the fact that I had two of the same type of things on it and it sort of crossed the, uh, there was a sort of a crossover in the, no. Is it because this water is terrible? What's going on with this? What if I used my hammer on it? <laughs> uh, pick it up, name, or open. No, I guess we can't. I don't know. It's very mysterious. I'm not... A Wait a minute. People keep telling me, oh, I can upgrade the well, but I shouldn't have to. Oh, I need cement mix for that. Yeah, we're not going to. But there's no other little info things here, right? No, there's no other little info things. It's basically just... It just tells you that there's a well. Um, volume 19.5 gallons, spoil rate 6 days, consumption reduces thirst briefly. Yeah, I don't really understand it. I make brand new clay jugs and they do, then, and they turn into crap and then if I mean look at this my my water my hydration is still going down. It's it's a mis I've been I've been sort of monitoring this um uh uh earlier today as well. This this is not Now if I eat um if I eat cornbread because cornbread has a bit of uh um it does have some thirst. It's like 10 thirst. Uh then it will my thirst will go up. But I don't want to do that. I don't. I shouldn't have to. I should be able to drink. So you know what we're going to do? Let's let's go down to the water. I know this is kind of a pain in the butt, but we're going to go down to the water and we're going to get some uh, get something to drink. There we go. And look at that. My thirst is going up now. If I if I hold E to collect water, what happens? Oh, that's weird. I the little green bar went up. <laughs> I don't. I. <laughs> It did 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 use did filling it with water down at the river fix it a little bit? I'm not sure. <laughs> There's something definitely funky with the uh, with that water jug. I don't I don't know what it is. And then if we refill it again, actually here let's just uh, empty it. Actually, can I just um, here? Let's try this. Can I just drop water? Oh, I can. Oh, I can just do. Uh, oh, that's weird. Oh, you go to the right. Okay. All right. So we've just dropped um, little packets of uh, loot bags of water. <laughs> Can you imagine someone coming along and seeing that and going, uh, you know, I, I, I find it really cool, by the way, that it uses my logo on it. That's really awesome. But people come along and they open it up and they go, why is there a bag of water? All right. So my jug is now empty. So what happens if I fill it up? Oh, it goes perfectly good. Okay, I think that the, I don't think that that's how it's supposed to behave. By the way, there's somebody down there. You know what we should do? Let's go find out who that is. Somebody built uh, just down the road from me. I wonder who it is. Do, 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 do. Oh, uh, Bluebirds Guild, neutral. Oh, I wonder if I know who this is. Let's see what we got. We've got a uh, a little patch of ground here. We've got, it says, um, I, I think it just says Bluebird's Guild. There's a bit of a shadow there, so it's hard to see. And then we have, that's an open room. 
the work. Oh, I don't know who this is actually. They got a shipping container. It's very simple. Well, welcome to the neighborhood, Bluebird. And then what do you have? You have a blue flag uh, with a lion. Oh, very impressive. All right. I think what we're going to do is, yeah. Well, anyways, welcome to the neighborhood. And I'm just going to head back to the base. All right. Oh, look at this. It's already done. That's okay. I should have extinguished it. Actually, I think if you extinguish it, you just lose the fuel anyways. But this is all finished burning up. I'll leave that in here so that I have something later. Oh, I have a candle too. Let me put the candle in the... Uh... There we go. Nice. Okay. I probably shouldn't have done that because I think it... I think it used up a candle just to give it a, a few extra minutes because it, it might be that there's a max of two hours. Anyways, all right, so um, there you go. So the mystery of the clay jug has been solved. It's a bit weird. Uh, I'm not really sure what that was all about. I mean, really, if you make a new clay jug, maybe if I took uh, like one of these clay jugs down, uh, I could basically repair it by, by emptying it and filling it up with water. I don't know. It's a bit strange. I suspect it's a bug. I don't think it's supposed to behave that way, but we're not going to worry about it. All right. By the way, I just noticed I had um, cotton on me. Uh, the reason why I have cotton on me is because I was making candles earlier because I was working at night. And, yeah, I have I have a candle here, and I have one over on the far corner there, and I have one uh, on this little wall right here. All right. So what is the main objective for today? The main objective for today, if we look in the technology page, as I say, is to... Uh, get up to a, an iron pickaxe. So I think we're going to do that. So first we need... No, I didn't mean to do that. I just meant to look at it. I need $300, four timber, and four copper ingots. Okay, let's grab um, half of this stack, which is going to be close enough to $300. Did I just sell a bunch of stuff and get money? No, I didn't. Wait a minute. Did I just look at that too quickly? No, I didn't. Okay, and we need um, some timber. Uh, let's just grab that. And then we need some iron ingots. So let's just grab, I don't know, seven of them. Uh, and take a look at what we need. Okay, I need, oh, copper ingots. Right, we have to go to copper technology before we go to uh, iron technology. Right. Actually, you know what? Keep that on. I'm going to need that anyways. So there we go. Oh, I actually don't have a lot of, I'm going to need to cook some copper. Oh, boy. Okay, so. Uh, yes. Yes. Nice. Okay, and now we're going to skip the copper pickaxe, and we're going to go straight for the iron pickaxe. So I just need six, uh, uh, $600 more, and I should be able to come up with that. We'll just grab a, a nice uh, nice stack of 1,000 here, and then no wrong one. There we go. Oh, yeah, look at that. Iron pickaxe. Yes, please. What is that? A hook pick. Oh, this is, um. oh, <laughs> thieves' tools. <clears throat> yeah, no, I don't need any of those right now. Uh, somebody mentions a, uh, mentioned a rake. Well, there's a scythe. And then there's a shovel. Uh, I think it had to do with gardening. Maybe they meant the hoe. Uh, used to create and remove a five by cropland seed can only be placed on cropland. Right. Okay, so the, 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 the stone one does a one by one grid. And the as you go up, it becomes more. So what's what is the difference between? All right, we should we well, I should be looking at this. So the the bone pickaxe uses it has a damage of four point eight one base, and it can harvest ten of things. The iron pickaxe has a seven point two two base, and it can harvest almost double eighteen point five. Is there like a platinum one? Oh, there's a steel pickaxe. It can do 23 harvest. You know, there's not a huge difference between 23 and 18. It is a difference, and I could actually get it. Um, unless, uh, what, is, what level am I? I am level 36, so, oh, I don't think I can. Oh, I got points I can put on. Um, let's do a little more health. Let's put this all into health. I've been putting a lot into weight, but I think health is more useful at this point so they don't get killed by, you know those people over there or a, a, a doe <laughs> uh, all right so now what we need to do is we need to make ourselves a pickaxe so i'm assuming we make it in the smithy and we have let's see where is it uh what is that right there stone tomahawk stone hatchet wait a minute am i right i might be do i have to upgrade the smithy now i think i might have to upgrade the smithy yeah, these are all stone and willow and... Okay, okay. So let's take a look at the... Um, 
All right. So uh, basically, uh, 30 brick and five iron ingot. Okay, no problem. We can do that. I've got the uh, I've got iron ingots. Let's put the extra copper that we have away and um, bricks. I think it said bricks. We got bricks. I can make more too. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna upgrade you. Six minutes. Oh my god, it's always so slow. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Oh, I shouldn't complain. Um, let's put that there and we'll put you away. Okay. So uh, what I really should do is actually go in here. Uh, and see what it actually says. So it's an iron pickaxe. It's crafted at the enhanced smithy. So yeah, I needed to uh, I needed to upgrade the smithy. So that makes sense. Two-handed melee weapon, uh, used for gathering ore from nodes. So that there you go. That now the nice thing about this is that it should speed up my grind, like when I go out and grind uh, for stuff, because 18.5 uh, from 10. That's almost double. So it should almost half the time. Not quite, of course. It's not you know, yeah. <laughs> All right. Now, um, while that's doing its thing, uh, we, let's, I wanted to... Okay. That's the primary goal, by the way, is I wanted to get going on the uh, on that iron pickaxe. Um, uh, but that's... No, no. All right. Okay. So, how much money do we have left? Let's put our... Let's put the uh, all the money back in here. Consolidate it. We have $1,700. Now... I could use that to try and get a better rifle, but before we do that, I want to just take a quick boo through the um, the technology here and just see if there's anything else. Like I could get a better water skin. Um, we could do we could get into some farming that might be useful. Now the scythe. Um, okay, does this stuff require money? Yeah, it does. All right, but the scythe. The scythe is uh, grass, cut grass or hay. You know what? Why don't we make a scythe? I'm, I'm kind of curious about that. So 24, okay, wood, stone, and sinew. Hell, I could come in here. We could just uh, grab the one sinew. And just, uh, let's see. Uh, we could, it'll be like the final hurrah of our bone pickaxe. Now, I think I've got some stone right here. That's not stone, buddy. <laughs> okay. And I think there's some down here, right over here. So let's just grab a bit of stone. I'm not going to get, I'm not going to go too crazy here, but. Um, okay. And then we can grab a bit of wood. Actually, can I just get wood using the pick? <laughs> it does not appear to be the case, although I might be wrong. Let's just do this over here on a tree and see what happens. Whoa! This thing's... A oh, these must be like woodless trees, like the ones... Here, what happens if I use a an axe on these? I've never... I think they go right through them as well. Oh. But I am getting wood. Hey, no. No. Okay, fine. <gasps> don't even... Don't even take your pants off, hey, bud? Is that is that the way we do things around here? I don't think so. This thing's a beast. Look at this. Holy moly. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, enough. <laughs> I think we've got enough to do the technology now. Um, <laughs> we might as well learn you, and what do I need to get you? I need a bit more wood. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're in luck. It's right here. Do, 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 do. These guys get more sticks than wood, but that's ah, okay. Sticks are useful, too. Uh, that's way more than I need. Oh, I'm going to show you something. Wow, this is kind of interesting. So let's finish off this tree. Wow, this tree actually has a lot for a little tree. Wow. Okay, I'm kind of impressed. That's the little tree that could. What? Seriously? Why? What? This doesn't make any sense. 200? Holy crap. That was, uh, that, that tree was amazing. But you'd think, okay, so here we have, look at this mighty tree. Look at how, look at how massive it is. Look, that thing's... It's, it's, you'd think that thing has huge amounts of lumber in it, right? All right. Well, we're going to get a little bit of wood. 
Let's see, 42, 48. We'll just, we're just going to find out because it's not as much as you might think. Oh, maybe it is. Okay. But it, it, it's the, uh, it's, it doesn't give you as much as those, the stumps, I don't think. That's the thing. 200. So it had the same, almost the same amount of wood as that other tree. All right, now. Uh, let's go and learn the, the hoe. All right, now what do we need to, oh, can we make uh, this, the stone thingamabobber in our pocket? I bet you we can. All right, so we can make a hoe. What do we need? Okay, we've got all the stuff. What about a scythe? Can I make a scythe? Scythe would be cool. Uh, you know, I should just do this. What the hell was that? Did, 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 did I hear a squeak? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I now have the eyes of a hawk. Maybe it was just the equipment running. The equipment makes odd noises. <laughs> Is there any animals around? There's like nothing. Holy moly. This area is like devoid of, of animals. The only thing you can hear is my base making things. How about over here? Is there anything over this way? There's like no animals. Wow. That's impressive. All right. Okay. Uh, right. Where were we? Okay. Yeah. Let's take a look. So uh, you crafted at the smithy. Okay, you have to craft the, the, the side of the smithy. I should, I should, you know, I get taken to task over that all the time. And quite rightly, I should be reading the instructions. Oh, are you done? No. 11 seconds. Wow, that's good timing. Holy moly. <laughs> so we are going to, um, after this, we're going to ask it to make a stone scythe. Just so that we can see how a scythe works. Because I think that would be, uh, I think that would be useful. I figured it was time. Provided instruction root is null. What? Root is null. No. No, 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 no. That is, that's an exception. It threw an exception on that. I didn't get my... Uh, I didn't get my... Oh! Oh, it's an... I needed to make an enhanced smithy first. I'm such a, uh, such a rube. Okay, first we're going to make a stone scythe because I bet you anything it doesn't take long at all. Right, and then we'll we'll tell once we get that made or tell it to make that. What we'll do is here. Let's just do this. There we go. We'll, what we'll do once we get that sorted out is we'll we'll tell it to make the uh, the stone axe, which is probably going to be take like half an hour or some. Well, no, it's not going to take half an hour, but you know what I mean. It's going to take a while. The stone scythe should be uh, quick. There we go. Let's craft you up. Two minutes. Yeah, that's much faster than what. So I have a question. A, a stone scythe, why a smithy uh, when it's made out of wood, sinew, and stone? What exactly, what exactly is this fire accomplishing at this exact moment? I ask you this. This is a question that I have. Developers. <laughs> They're not answering. Okay, so now what do we need in order to make a... Um, Let's get ready for the, the next one. So this won't take long at all. But so I want to make the axe. We should be able to make a stone pickaxe. Oh, no, the, uh, the iron pickaxe. So I need uh, two timber and two iron ingots. So I have right now enough uh, timber and I don't have enough ingots. So what we're going to do, first of all, is we're going to basically throw a bunch of wood in here and get it cooking. Just because. Um, grab a couple of iron ingots. I just wanted to get the weight off of me. Now, those went up some... There we go. And actually, just double-click it. There we go. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to chuck some of these extra bits and pieces into the stockpiles so that I don't... Because, you know, I mean, it's kind of nice when you don't have to find stuff later. You know, it's just right here. And... Uh, oh, my stone stockpile is full. Okay. You know what I could do uh, is grab some stone and one, 
two, three, four, five, six. I'm probably exhausted and running slow. That's fine. And then we'll just I'll I'll get the uh, the workbench crafting some more stone blocks, because it's like I I'm basically constantly telling it to whoa no. There we go. Constantly just just because it just takes so long. Um. All right. So. See, it says 608. Now, if I ask it to make uh, 600, right? So that's that should be, there you go. And then I've got eight stone left. So it should now have, in 29 minutes, which is, we're not going to be here, uh, but it should finish. But what will often happen, even if I did do exactly what I just did now, I come back later and it says resume and ran out of materials. There is, I think, something funky with it. Okay, how's it going with the... Uh, Oh, zero seconds. That means that it's almost done. <laughs> oh, there it is. We've got ourselves a, a side. Nice. Okay. And then the next thing we can do is we can tell it to make the... Um, can, do we have... Yes, we do. Okay. And then I can put the extra timber away so because I, I, don't, I don't need it on me. There we go. And um, what else? Copper. Ah, good enough. How's my weight? Uh, if you want to see your weight, you just tab and it gives you 145 that's not too bad i've got some extra materials on me like that that clay for example i could put the clay away um but and i've got onesies of stuff often if i have these little onesies of things what i do is i just come in here chuck it into the the who's a what's it's like this um and then just ship it it's it's quick i mean it's what how much am i going to get for that a dollar seventy one, but it's it's not in my inventory anymore. It's super fast. Okay, so uh, we have a scythe. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Let's see what a scythe can do. Uh, now the I believe it was uh, someone referred to it as a rake, but I think they were I think it was just a slip of the tongue. Uh, they meant the scythe, and I think the scythe. Whoa, 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 oh, whoa fella. <laughs> okay, uh, I think all it does is it gives you the ability to. Um, well, maybe I'm wrong. How come it doesn't show me as harvesting anything? That's weird. Select current shape one by one. Okay. Oh, three by one. Interesting. Okay, so if I come over here... It does it depend on what it is? So it's clearing the land. So what if I go to a three by one? Okay. A little bit of fiber. So I am getting materials out of this, fiber and grass, but not near as much as I would think I would get. I mean, I get, here, let me show you. So if, here, here, let's do get more. Let's get a bit more. That is a bit, a bit strange because I'll show you. If I go to the bone uh, bone axe, right? And if I just come over here like this and go, I get, I get, look at that. I get all kinds of stuff and it's quick. See, I've got 38 fiber. Um... <clears throat> I might be misunderstanding here. What does this say? It says it's a... Okay, so it's a used to cut up a, a grass or hay. Three by one grid. Maybe it's used for specific materials. Maybe if you had a... Maybe you need a hay field for it. Maybe, you know, this is not... This is not a hay field, so... But I am getting fiber and, uh, you know, mixed seeds and crap out of it. So you'd think that I would be... Uh, hang on. It does make an impressive sound. <laughs> Let's just go one by one. There we go. You know, I am getting stuff out of it. Maybe it, maybe it's just, you know, maybe the, the axe is just a, a, because it's a higher on the food chain as far as uh, technology is concerned. Maybe it just does better. All right. I mean, I've got, you know, uh, 210 fiber. That's not bad. Whoa, look at him go. <laughs> wow, that's impressive. <laughs> he, 
He looks very angry. Here, I want... Get rid of that. Okay. All right. Here, put that away. You're gonna, like, you're gonna trip and impale yourself on that thing. Uh, now this thing is probably gonna take a little longer, right? Two minutes. Not, eh, not too much longer. But that fiber is nice because now we can basically take that fiber and then we can convert that into thread. Like that. In fact, that's how I got, uh, the five, that's how I got the 66 thread. I've been making my own. I know, I learned. I learned these things. All right, now, while that is cooking off, Let's see. Let's let's take a, another quick look at the thing. We were going to make... Uh, oh, we have a hoe. Nice. Okay. So I wanted to take a look at the hoe as well. All right. So the hoe used to create and remove a one-by-one -one grid of cropland. Seed can only be placed on cropland. Okay. Let's... Um, you know what? Why don't we uh, figure out where we want to put a garden? I think that would be kind of cool. Now, my property... Let's take a look at the map. Here's my property. I'm standing right here. Um, essentially, uh, and then that's the river down there. Uh, I, I have basically from my house is up here. And then I have down towards the water. And then my stockpiles run down here. The, the big stone base that I just put up is like right in right here. So really, my, my sort of area where I can grow crops is really kind of over on this far side. Like over here, right? I'm on, And I'm thinking, I'm thinking... No, not there. Maybe... Um, see, let, let's... Hang on. Uh, if you want to see where your property line really is uh, very conveniently, is you basically just hold the... There. And that... The, hold the hammer, and it tells you that, you know, there's the property line right there. So I could I could put a nice little uh, farm right in here. This, this looks like a nice spot. What do you think? I think it's great. Okay. Okay, so one one whack. Now, it says add and remove one. So if I do this again, does it not remove it? I would think it would remove it. Ah, right click. So right click to remove and uh, left click to add. So there we go. Do, 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 do. That's right. We're just hoeing. Me and my hoe. Dig in a furrow. Is it a furrow? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I, think, I think my family and his, historically were farmers, but uh, I know nothing about farming. Uh, only that uh, farmers are amazing because they feed us. <laughs> and without them, we'd all starve. <laughs> so thank you, farmers. <laughs> there we go. Oh, this is not bad. This is actually fairly simple. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier. Uh, and I've got a I've got a watering jug, so I can actually water stuff now too. Okay. Do, 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 do. And yes, yes, yes. Now that oh, there's actually a big log there. All right, I think maybe one more 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 row. Uh, I believe that is the correct lingo. Uh, and if we do that. Don't hit the tree. Don't hit the tree. Okay. There we go. So I think that's a reasonable little starter sort of thing. Now, the problem is it sort of, it looks like it does give kind of rows. Eh, it's pretty cool. Look at, look at, when you walk through it, it leaves footprints and, and dusty things. That's cool. Okay. So let's put that away. And um, I want to plant something in there now. I'm guessing I need seed, right? So, um, before we get into that, whoa, rubber band. Actually, let's do that first. Let's do that first. Let's take a look in here because um, foodstuffs, furniture, stations, ammunition, apparel, farming. Okay, so there are, you can buy like cotton seed and fertilizer. Now, I have mixed seed. I don't know what mixed seed is. I'm assuming, let's take a look. I'm assuming what this mixed seed is. Um, is basically unknown seed. It's basically seed that, uh, you know, you go out and you just sort of gather stuff, and then there's, like, seeds, and you don't know what they are. And then you plant them, and then different plants will come up. Uh, as opposed to, I'm guessing, and it, as I say, this is all just guessing, so I'm, I could be completely wrong. 
uh, getting the specific seed because I don't know if in here, turnip, tomato, see what is the mixed seed looks like it's kind of got this weird mixed look to it i don't see anything like that here so i'm assuming that you can't buy mixed seed you can buy only specific seed so i think what we'll do is we'll use some of our mixed seed first and then just to get a feel for this right and then we'll go from there okay now i guess i have to water it too right what do i do do i just put the seed in my hands Oh, okay. Sa Server will save in 15 minutes. Thank you. Uh, one by one, three by one. Okay. If I do a three by one and I go, hey, I could do that. Oh, it planted. Okay. So then I could do three. There we go. And one. Actually, you know what I should do? Here, let's, uh, let's do this. One more here and here and here and then, you know, and then, you know, big surprise here. Yeah, I know. It's shocking, right? Okay. So we'll grab our mixed seed, which uh, we have. Wow, we have a fair amount of it still left. Do one there and then one there. And then the, uh, the other rows, I can just go to three like this. I, I could have just gone from up there, but and then just do like that. Do, 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 do. Farmer, oh no. And then three. No, no. Okay, you could. Yes, that works too. Oh, wow. So one, okay, 27. This should be 24. Yes, so it uses one seed per, uh, per square, right? So I should have uh, enough to finish this off, I'm pretty sure. Uh, although my math may be off but I believe it's nine per thing. And so there was less than 18 left uh, to sow. Okay. Now, there we go. Oh, no. And done. Okay, so uh, now how do I know whether it's too dry or not? I don't, I have no idea. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab our uh, thingy, thingamabobber here. And uh, can I do more than... Oh, I can only do one. Oh, this is so slow. Oh, my God. This is going to take forever. There must be a faster way to do... <gasps> no! No, oh, God! Urgh. Oh, look at the blood! Look at the blood! I'm bleeding! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you jerk! <laughs> oh, I can't believe I got bitten by a doe while I was farming. This is absolutely incredible. <laughs> okay, no, get out of there. Oh, look at all the blood. Look at the blood. That I'm serious doe. Okay. <laughs> look at that. Look at that! Look at that. He, uh, the injury! Oh my goodness! A level thirty-four doe. That's actually um, is that is that fairly high level? I don't even know. All right. Okay. Can I actually uh, get the doe? Yes. Um, <clears throat> this might take a while. So yeah. Oh, and I'm bleeding too. <laughs> Oh, this is absolutely hilarious. Here, how about this? Let's just, uh... <laughs> let's bandage myself up from my dough damage. Is it just... Am I the only one that plays this game that gets attacked by doughs all the time? I mean, I never... I, I know that, that people have been attacked by them, but I never hear about it. And I don't know. Maybe they maybe they just hate me. I, do, is there something about me that, that these doughs don't like? I have no idea what it is. <sighs> all right. Um, I'll be right back. It's all done. You can look now. <laughs> Except for the greasy stain on the ground over there. Oh, let's take a quick look. Uh, I got 24 meat 
Um, uh, I don't know if I had sinew on me, but I don't think I did because I think I only grabbed one. So 13 sinew, a doe skin, which is nice. I should, uh, yeah, I should put that on the wall. Uh, my wall walls will be covered. Um, and 544 uh, giblets. So there we go. That's actually pretty good. Oh, and I think I got some hides. Where are the hides? Oh, and I got fat too. Nice. And six hides. Sweet. So that's actually really good. Um, saves me having to buy it. Don't pull out your gun. Man, sometimes I, I, I log in and he's just holding it. <laughs> um, oh, I guess I should probably water, but I can't tell. Is this... Is this... is Like, you can't really... There's no visual difference between that and that. All right, I'm going to assume that it's fine. So we're we're just going to walk away from that. I watered some of it and I didn't water other. I did watered like one row before the doe came and attacked me. Um so we'll at least, you know, I'll be able to see what if there's a difference between this side and that side later on if this decides to grow which it may not because I have no idea what I'm doing and I'm only making uh like a whole crap ton of assumptions. Yeah. That's me. Um 13. Okay, why did that not refill? Can I not? That's right. Not worried about that. <coughs> we have we have other things to worry about. The first thing is I should have what is this? Uh, 31 minutes. Might as well grab the charcoal out of there. We're going to basically sh uh, shove you, you, and you in here. We're just going to cook all that up. Uh, I'm going to sell the, the, the giblets. Most I'm probably going to sell the meat too, by the way, because it goes bad before I can even eat it. Uh, so we're just going to, you know, get rid of that. It's, you know, $9. It's not it's not a lot, but it's, uh, it's something. And I think I'm going to keep the other stuff because it's useful. Yes, I picked some poppies. <laughs> oh, you know what? Somebody asked, why do you pick the poppies? And I'm like... Because, no, I think that they have some medicinal value. Uh, that is my hope. That is what I'm thinking. I don't know if it's true. So we're going to, I, I do want to take a look. Now, the seeds I think I was putting in here. Yeah, let's just put those away there. All right. Um, oh, I knew I was forgetting something. You. There we go. You know what I could do is... Grab a bunch of copper, and I've got a bunch of charcoal. I might as well just cook this stuff up. Why not? There we go. Good enough. Okay, so, um, because I'm low on ingots. Where were we? Oh, yes! Ha-ha! <laughs> nice. That is so nice. Oh, by the way, I should check something else. Uh, so the woodcutter's axe, I was getting... 16 num like uh, when you hit things and you harvest it gives you like a floating number i guess it's the amount of damage that you're doing i was it was doing 16 to the dough and it says it's 18 for harvesting wooden shrubs so uh if we take a quick look there's got to be uh maybe for food no uh is there where are the knives oh here's a knife so it's it's uh, harvesting meat. Okay. So, oh, you can use a sharp rock for harvesting meat. Oh, yeah. By the way, this is from uh, Reign of Kings 2. Uh, you basically um, you used to get captured a lot. So what you do is you make a sharp rock because it's a great way of killing yourself. Then, you, uh, then it says it can be hidden in your orifice. I will leave that to your imagination as to what orifice that is. <laughs> Anyways... <laughs> And so, basically, um, you if you got stuck in a, a, a jail cell, you could, uh, you know, um, escape, sort of, by, <laughs> by, by pulling out your knife, your stone thing from your orifice, and then using it <laughs> to, you know, to, to end your misery. Anyways, <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> All right, so we're going to lose, uh, oh, the server's going to save in five minutes. Okay, so we have... Uh, we have our, here, let's put that there and there, side by side. So 18.5 harvest versus 8, oh. That doesn't make sense. I think there's crossover. I think the game has a, 
difficulty uh, sometimes. 7.22. If I, if I put that axe, that pickaxe away, I think it's a bug. If I put the pickaxe away, that's 18.5. Now, if I grab you, 18.5. All right, well, I'm not really sure. Uh, see, because if we take a look in here, 18.5 harvest. <clears throat> the uh, the stone p is 10 harvest, right? So I think there's some, I think that uh, that's a bug. Um, I think my, because I have the iron pickaxe on me, it's, it's basically going to be, uh, it's 18.5 across the board, and it's remembering 18.5. So what we're going to do is we're going to come up here, uh, basically to these rocks because it's where I know there's a bunch of materials like I don't know right here and we're gonna try this out I was gonna do an a some a B testing um, where you use one and then the other to see the difference but I don't think there's gonna be a difference because I think it's got I don't think that this whoa <laughs> nice oh yeah okay so I, I do believe that this is significantly faster yeah. So there you go. I've got myself a nice iron pickaxe. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's so awesome. And I'm hungry and thirsty, too. Do, 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 do. We should hang on. It's just going to have a snack. All right. Where were we? Do, 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 do. <laughs> Uh, he's going to run out of mass. This is, a, this, I think this is actually, um, it is faster. Now, it's just an impression, by the way. I'm not counting or measuring. Okay. He's, he's all full up. He's all full up. All right, let's run down. And, uh, we'll dump some of it into the stone stockpile. Although I think I might have, I think I might have, uh, are you full already? No, not yet. Okay. Nice. Did I get any iron out of that? I should have. I did. All right. Well, I think, um, yeah, I think that's pretty good. So, yeah, we, I think we got quite a bit done. We, we, uh, we investigated a lot of the tools. Today was really all about tools. And we got some farming done. Oh, look, my plants are coming up. Now, isn't that interesting? So did I successfully water that part? Because I, I planted that after I planted... Oh, there's some plants coming up down here, too. And over here. I didn't water over here, I don't think. Maybe I did. Okay, so maybe it's just different types of plants. Bet you that's what it is. Some plants take uh, uh, grow faster than others. And because I was using mixed seed, it might be random. But there we go. So we were using... Uh, we did a bit of uh, farming. I made iron tools... We made a hoe. We made a... Su Whoa! Holy crap! Look at how fast this is growing. Oh, that's impressive. That is actually really cool. Now, now I just have to understand how to harvest it. I'm not exactly sure what it is. All right, the server is going to save in one, one minute. We're, so <laughs> I think what we're going to do is I'm going to call it here. Uh, I think this is pretty good. Uh, now, there is a way to hide the thingamabobber, but we're going to just take a picture like that just for our album. And, uh, we're, yeah, we're going to call this a, uh, we're going to call this a win. Look at them. They're all sprouting up. Isn't that awesome? All right. Thank you very much, everyone. Hey, hi. Can you, does the, does the voice thing work? I can never tell whether the voice thing yes. works. Hey, how's it going? Yes. Good. How are you? I'm good. Um, so I, I can't. Jabber's behind you. Hey, Jabber. How you doing, man? Are you, what, what are you shooting me for? <laughs> how are you doing guys oh server <laughs> all right well i'm gonna i'm gonna have a chat with jabber and i don't know who that is so uh i have to take a closer look um i think i, I did recognize the voice but i don't want to say in game yeah Good. server save sheesh server save <laughs> all right uh so I think we'll end it here. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.